All right, everybody, we're back for part two. I spent a lot of last night and all day today organizing the Lucky Penny nice. for our trip tomorrow. So I'm excited to show you what it looks like. Let's see it. So I put the awning out for you with the lights on. Isn't that nice? Dang, I like the underglow too. Yeah. This is cool. Look at that, guys. Aw, oh, snap. All right, guys, I'm about to see it for the first time. Whoa. <laughs> what do you think? The rug? Yeah. Just a blanket. That is a, <laughs> that's a traditional Airstream. Check see? this out. The trailer. <laughs> that's awesome. <laughs> and then, look at I even got this here. It's a Christmas ornament. Oh, that's cute. You guys gotta have a, a really, really tiny tree in here somewhere. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you wanna shut the door then? It's cold in here. I like the carpet a lot. It's a ruggable, so I can rip it up and wash it. Nice. Yeah. So, I got the kitchen ready. Not everything for our trip, because tomorrow I'm gonna be putting more things, but we have oatmeal and snacks and nuts and seasonings and things nice. to cook with. And Ooh. we have drinks and Phil's yogurt. And I tried these things to yeah, keep them say, from things? rattling. Oh, uh, like okay. Falling out. Um, are these like specifically made for that purpose? No, I found them in the dollar section at Target. What's, the, what's it for? I'm not sure. <laughs> but oh, I works. also have them here. So these little <clears throat> bottles, yeah. Um, they don't rattle okay. in here. So I'm pretty excited about those. That's cool. And then, prior to today, see I made soup in my little super cubes. <laughs> you gotta get a close up to that. Check Homemade out, soup. Soup cubes. Oh. <laughs> and we could have some apple crisps, pre-made. So that all this is gonna Check last. Out the the breakfast sandwich. You can speak to these, right? Yeah, no, they're good. I put them in my air fryer. So that it'll be pretty much our trip. That's a fuse box. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. This too? No, that's a little drawer. We have our pens and tape and nice. remotes. Okay. I was able to see above that, Derek. I was able to get the Roku in there. Ooh. Yeah, so we watched uh, TV last night. Yeah, I was going to say, you guys should be in this like every day until <laughs> We forever. slept in it last night until 1 in the morning. Dang. Because we accidentally plugged in <laughs> to the outlet that we plug the Christmas lights in and it shuts off at midnight so we yeah. no heat after <laughs> <laughs> That's funny. So I got our, remember this one we opened up was empty? Yep. So we have our plates and our dishes and cups and different things for cooking. So you got the bedding on the bed now? We do. That's we cool. didn't. We didn't open the bed. We should do that. Cups, quiet, Yeah. no rattling. That's really smart. I feel like that's something I wouldn't have thought about. Silverware, <laughs> knives. It's like a full set. Fry some uh, eggs in the morning. Yeah. Very important bottle opener for beer. Bam. Wine opener. Bam. Auntie Marie brought us a bottle of wine today, so it's safe travels on it. Nice. And then, let me show you the closet. Okay. <clears throat> Good deal for the closet. So I took the shelf out and I added these. Look at their magnetic. Yeah. So Phil has two, I have two, and yet we can still hang some things. Okay. How many days worth of clothes can you roughly fit in here, do you think? Well, this is only for the weekend, but we could fit a lot. Like four for... days maybe if you had a time? Oh, easy. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. There's more. There's more room. I didn't fill everything that we could. Yeah. This is just toilet paper and towels. Our coffee maker. Our, uh -huh. That our coffee maker would fit under the sink, but it doesn't. Okay. We have our hiking shoes in there. And then... I was pretty excited about this because nice. I found these organizers. It's like everything you need. Yep. Yeah. Everything you need. Cool. 
I would open these are nice and organized, but it has our own lunch. Oh, here she showed the medicine cabinet breaking all HIPAA rules, but she won't show our underwear. <laughs> we don't really have medicine. <laughs> and then all of our cleaning supplies. Now, look at how magical, how perfectly wow. those fit. Well, nothing. Some people, when they don't plan, they put their stuff in, close it, and then when after travel day, they open it and it all yeah. comes flying out. So these will not. Nice. When I was watching the video of me yesterday in it, mm -hmm. It feels like... I know, I like how you put the water feature on it. Oh, yeah. So. It feels like I'm in, like, some type of chamber. Like, I'm going to become a superhuman. And, like, <laughs> and then I open it, it's just shh, ton of fog. <laughs> I just come out super strong. <laughs> or, hon, what was that called on Star Trek? They go under the little... Um, they would stand under the oh, tube thing. they're getting beamed up. Beamed yeah. up. Beamed <laughs> up, Scotty. The, yeah, we have cables there. I got our gloves and hats in the morning. It'll be cold. We have our manuals over here. Um, what else do we have? We have some umbrella. Right. Um, that is just for something so it won't rattle or fall out because I thought this was kind of weird. But I could put stuff in there if I needed to. Oh, okay. I see. But let's... um. Let's do the bed since we didn't do it. So take that armrest off, Derek, for me, and put it in the passenger seat. And then there is a button in the end here. Mm. You just keep holding it? Yep. And then there you go. There's a latch down there. Pull the latch. And then at the same time. A latch. Like here? The black latch, pull it towards you. Okay. Nice. These straps obviously come off when you go to bed, and then there's pillows down there. And you just, there's little lights, mm -hmm. reading lights, USB ports. This is a whole window, the shade is down, obviously. Yeah. There's lots of USB. Yes. Cool. Yes, there are. Front two in the front for the couch, yeah. by the bed. Oh, whoops. Can you flip that back up toward the wall there? You want me to pull the pillow up or is no. that fine? No, that's fine. Oh, the latch. Sorry. Oh. And then you do that button again the opposite way. And there you go. Nice. Oh, sorry. <laughs> Took them out. So we, we, uh, it was kind of funny because we, we wanted to fill up the tank a little bit, the fresh water tank. Yeah. So I went downstairs, opened the valve again because I had everything shut down for the winter. Had to get on a ladder, do, do all that. Mm -hmm. Had to had to pull the slide out in. Had to disconnect the everything to pull the camper forward so we could fill up the water tank, right? Yeah. So we did that, and we you know we never done it before. So we hear you know we hear the water going in the tank, and it's sounding kind of weird. But then then all of a sudden we got done, backed everything up, went down, turned you know turned off the water, put the hose away, everything, and there's. A big stream of water <laughs> going down the street. We had the fresh water tank open. <laughs> so as we're filling it, it's draining <laughs> just as fast. <laughs> so then what we have to do, I had to crawl underneath. That's why I got all these sweats on. Yeah. Close the valve. Then I had to go back downstairs, <laughs> turn it in, ladder, this and that, yeah. slide out in, pull forward, do it all over again. Jeez. Well, at least now you know the whole setup. So yeah, That's we just learn everything the hard way. Yeah. Can you imagine like parking by a cliff and like you just walk out and that's your view? That's going to be mm -hmm. awesome. Yeah, and if, when you do and it's a beautiful day, you can just open the door. Yeah. Dang. That's so cool. How does it feel to finally have everything done? <sighs> After 13 months of waiting and, you know, 
It people was. not following through with the right dates. It was. It was a long wait, but man, it was worth it. She's very, uh, she's very homey, and yeah. she's she's just the right size for two people. Mm -hmm. And I'm looking forward to going Can't on wait our to first hit the road. Yeah, it's yeah. mm -hmm. yeah. awesome. My first drive is going to be a off ramp to on ramp, just the freeway, mm -hmm. until I get gutsy enough to do regular streets yeah so phil can get a break <laughs> right i sat in that thing and i just trying to learn everything so i'm not learning it while i'm driving it mm -hmm. i made sure it's got the the lane assist it's got the you know the braking thing so that if you're not paying attention and it keeps you in the lane it'll yeah. break for you if you're not yeah. braking so that's awesome we're ready we will uh send you updates Maybe the third part of this series can be some content from your trip and, oh, yeah. you know, maybe people would be interested in you guys starting a channel. Mm -hmm. Just like that Netflix thing that you showed me or yeah, whatever he got picked up by. Mm -hmm. yeah. That would be fun. We might have to hire a videographer. <laughs> our, our, our bar is set pretty low for the first trip. We're just yeah. going to be super excited to be in a park and not have to look for the restrooms. Right. <laughs> that's that's mm -hmm. our bar right now. Does this have any type of privacy thing? Mm -hmm. Yeah, so we put it up last night. It's very easy. It's in here. Yeah. So there, you put it on the windshield. There's a little strap around the mirror. Mm -hmm. And then you close the visors down, and that holds it. Okay. And then the two on the side windows, it's like a magnet. And it was completely dark. Nice. Yeah. That's cool. Mm-hmm. And we just keep finding things. Like Phil found today, and we have storage up there. Yeah. Goes. That's where I got my sunglasses and my earbuds and when I'm driving. Mm-hmm. It's a really sweet setup. You definitely did a really good job pulling everything together. So now my next goal is to figure out a way to mount over time, do some personalization. So maybe mm -hmm. some photos from our trips. Yeah. Somehow here, because there's not a lot of wall space, as you can tell. Right. In here. Yeah. Maybe a shelf, so I could put my spices when I'm cooking. Mm -hmm. But so these two spots will be my future. I have to figure that out. Okay. I'm sure this time tomorrow we're going to have a list about this long of everything we forgot. Yeah. <laughs> I will be very surprised. I have thought about this for a long time. I'll be disappointed in myself if we forgot anything. Well, congratulations. Very Thank happy you. for you guys. Got a lot of good comments on the last video. Oh, yeah? What was your favorite? All right, guys. So my mom just asked what her favorite comment was on the last video. And I want to give a special shout out to Alexander. Do you want to read Alexander's comment? Alexander. Listen, this Mercedes RV is stunning. Ugh, I want to ride in it. Come scoop me, LOL. Congratulations, Mama Suze and Papa Phil. Oh, <laughs> thank you, Alexander. That was very nice. Very nice. <laughs> Perfect. Nice. All right, guys. Well, thanks for giving us a final tour, and we're excited to see the progress as you guys add more stuff. Bon voyage. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Good thing there is no cliff there. <laughs> Sick. You gonna bring the slide out in? I was just gonna say that because I bring the slide out. Yeah. That's so cool. Alright, y'all. Well, thanks for watching this video. I'll see you in the next one. Hope you guys have a good rest of your day. Bye.